Hello everyone, welcome to another Grand Peace online video and in this video I'm gonna go ahead and go to the next island that I'm thinking of going to and that is gonna be Roca Island. Now before we actually go to Roca Island we will get in touch with one more island which was the next island that I'm supposed to go to but I'm not gonna go to right now because I need to be done with the last quest which of course I need to level up a lot to be able to go there or to be able to defeat the boss of this island so we're gonna um, just go to Shell's town and then directly to Roca Island now the reason why I don't want to stay here is of course because the quest is a little bit hard and I need to level up a lot more for me to be satisfied with one hitting the boss. I recommend you to watch other people's like YouTubers who figure out how to easily defeat the boss here using other tactics than leveling up. But for me leveling up is just the main essential thing that I would like to do. So let's go ahead and of course um summon our boat there you go and we're gonna go to the north side north side is the best possible way to go to right now it's because that's where shell towns is it's in north side of sandora going to the north will allow you to go to the shell's town which we're gonna go east to be able to go to roca island now hopefully we get to go there as fast as possible but it's gonna take a while of course so let's just hopefully wish that we go to the destination that we're going right now but for now let's just um go take the boat go straight forward north side and see if we're gonna go to our destination that's the whole thing going to wherever we're going I'm just going to fast forward and see if we're there. Okay, we are now near an island that is in front of us and this island here is probably shell's town so i've heard looking at the map right now because sometimes the map could be inaccurate and it's better to just follow your instinct and go north side than going northeast but i think this is shell's town yet is a peaceful yet dangerous town now the next thing that i'd recommend you to do after you hit shell town is go to the side of shell town and then go east so that is the next destination i am gonna go eastwards oh oh what the heck what the heck i'm gonna go eastwards let's go east i'm um, just gonna go over here on this side and then go east this time so let's go ahead let's go east and let's see if we're going to the right destination or we're in a totally wrong destination because this here is supposed to go to roca island so let's see if we actually get ourselves to roca island this is one of my recommendations to do when you go to when you're in sandora and trying to get yourself a katana which i'm planning to do that's the only reason why i'm going to roca island i want to get myself a katana i'll come back again and get myself the sword style but for now, I want the katana. And so, we're going to Roca Island. Later on, if you are confused and you're in different parts of the map, then I just recommend you to go all the way back to Shelltown. There should be um, a, like, this thing here, the legacy post which will show you the direction where the shell town is that's one thing that i recommend you to do if you want to do that but for now i was just gonna follow where i think is rightfully correct because this is one big map and you might get lost so i'd recommend you to get every single log post that you possibly can 
because it's the best way to be able to move around the whole place so yeah i'm gonna go ahead once again fast forward so that you don't have to hear me talk so much We are now seeing an island right in front of us. I think this is Roka Island. By the way, I've never been in this island before, so I do not know if I'm in the right island or not. But hopefully I am, and let's go find, let's go look around Roka Island and see if there's anything worth taking or remembering to get in this island. So this island here has, you can go at any level to this island, but, or however, you get absolutely nothing in this island. Because this island here is a peaceful island, meaning there's no mobs for, for you to get beaten up to. So let's go ahead and do that. Our boat is, of course, health is going hella down. Let's now go to this here. I think this is Roka Island. Did it show the sign that says Roka Island? Let's see here. There are... This is the island. This is what it looks like. There's a hole here. And I guess this is... Um, some, but something's gonna be here, of course. Is there? Is there anything in here? Okay, there's nothing in here. I was expecting something, like, nice to have in here. But I guess it's just a big cave with absolutely nothing inside of it let's get out of here and see what we can find outside let's go up here we're gonna see a person which i guess is um eternal pose and you can buy one for this island which costs 2000 pelly which right now i do not have unfortunately i'm just gonna go back to shell's town and, ooh, there's three chests here. I'm gonna make a video about that, where to find the chest. I guess you just have to go all the way up. Then we see what we can see, look at in this place. Oh, I can't jump this? Oh, it is jumpable. So I can't jump it. There you go, let's get up here. There's houses right over here. Is there any house even worth looking at inside? Let's go in. There isn't much in here. There's bed, there's chairs, there's furniture. Let's go in here. I think it's the same. There's no furniture. Not much furniture inside this house. Let's go up here. There's just filled with trees and all that stuff. Uh, oh, there's a staircase here. There's rocks filled with... Oh, there's another stair staircase here. Huh. There's, there's a staircase here. Okay. Okay, so, okay. Okay, the chest here. You didn't need to work your ass off to go up there. There's a t staircase here. Okay. Uh, there's another staircase. Small staircase. And we get to look at the top of this island. I don't see much. But we can look all over the place to see if any secrets or anything cool hidden in here there isn't that much let's go inside the building this is the first oh there's the peep person here and this is jackie now what jackie does is is gonna train you the one sword style but it will cost cash which i'm not worth uh it's not worth testing right now i'll test it once i actually bought the sword which is the katana. And there is the katana right over here. I'm gonna go ahead and take the katana. It's cost 999 pelly. Click yes, and we just get ourselves a katana. There you go. Let's go down here and then look at the katana, of course. Let's equip it. Go to the inventory. Unequip the Sandora log post. Um, unequip the hammer we don't need that right now and let's equip the katana where's the katana there it is we got ourselves a katana 
God damn, look at this. Also, let's go to our... This here, let's give five in Sword Mastery. I think it was gonna help. Okay, this is just random here. So this is a katana. It We don't have a sword style yet because we need to buy the actual sword style to get its move. And then we go in here and there's nothing more. So this is what the island, this is all the island has to offer. It gives you a katana and of course a sword style master. So that is, um, that is the Roka Island. We just went to it. And right now, I will be going to different islands and level up myself. Of course, I'm going to guide you the way through the islands. And of course, I'm going to go one by one, show you them. But for now, this should be it. I'm in Roka Island. And I guess I just have to work hard while I'm here. Yes, uh, thanks for watching and bye.